Nintendo. Oh yeah. Yup. Yup. Yeah, I thought, you know what? I thought it's time. I thought it was friggin' time. Mario Sunshine is the game that came out on 2002 for the Nintendo GameCube. And upon its arrival, we all immediately got horny. Will Peach be in a bikini? Will Mario show off his truffle shuffle? What exactly is going to happen? Do, do I need to watch the intro video? Do, is, that, is that a thing I have to do? Um, this game, I'm probably going to yell um, once or twice before the end and if I don't uh, I think I deserve a prize Mario? <laughs> uh, this game it, it does the one thing that I wish it, it no Mario game should and it sort of locks you into what what like stars and shit you can get and that that was always so annoying i love the story though we now find out that peach has a jet plane is in is contributing to mushroom kingdom global warming um i love that the island is shaped like a dolphin i love that isle delfino was in mario odyssey and made us all fucking think it was probably coming out but god damn if i didn't have a fucking great ass time with this game as a child. Yeah, that's where that one is. Nope, still haven't beat it. <laughs> Fun fact, I've never beaten this game. And it was based on false information. Someone told me you needed like 75 shines to get to Bowser at the end. Oops, spoilers. It's a Mario game. Fuck you. But, uh, yeah. Didn't know that. It's like 50? You need like 50 shines to beat this game. And you can go fight Bowser. 55? It's some super low number, which... By the way, the fact that Nintendo made it such a super low number to me... <clears throat> speaks volumes that even Nintendo knew this fucking game is hard. There are just some infamously famous... Infamous, famous, infamous, famous... God, look at the look on her face. Can she? Her eyes do not let her experience emotion. Anyways, you know, we all love the fucking eight red coins, don't we? We all love the eight red coins floating on the uh, sand bird. Oh, yeah, lots of fun. That level where you, they take away your flood and the whole level is covered in lava. That's a fun fucking thing. Uh We There we go. My other the other thing I hate about this game is all of the little Mario platforming levels. The one where they take away the flood and it's literally just jump. Jump and get to the end. And it's like, "Oh, okay. The angle at which Mario slips." And, you know, you lose control and you most likely are falling off the level. I feel like it's fucking different every time. There's, like, no angle that makes me say, oh, God, I'm going to slip. And it, it gets really annoying. But, again, we'll, uh, we'll see. I actually had a little bit of fun in my playthrough that you all just saw. I got 48 shines. I might have to go beat that so I can say I've beaten it once. Uh, and then embarrass in embarrassing fashion, and this was the start of the crown uh, being handed over. My brother beat this game, like, without even trying. And he waited. He waited to fight Bowser until he had, like, 70-ish or so shine sprites. And I think that's why I looked at it, and I'm like, well, I'm never going to get to 70. But, yeah, I... I this game is like my thing in terms of setting. I love the fucking setting. Anything tropical on a beach, sign me the hell up. 
Like, just sign me up. I'm, I am for... Jesus, really? That took way too long. Look, you can do this. You can go blah blah blah. And everyone has shut off the video. I don't even blame you. Oh boy, this is gonna be with the Nintendo Switch Pro Controller. It's, oh, it's the shooting button. You know what? I remember, too. It, it takes some getting used to with this controller. It's not as detrimental as, uh, you know, playing Mario 64 without... Although, you know what? All these 3D Mario games actually work okay with the controller. Mostly because one is the camera and one is you walking around. So it seems to work out for Mario. But there was something about that GameCube controller. I'm so sad the GameCube was like Nintendo's worst selling console of all time. Why? There were some fucking bangers on that thing. Luigi's Mansion, this? <clears throat> Star Fox Adventures? I know I didn't like it. I definitely had some issues with it. But Metroid Prime, it seems like it's fondly remembered. Like, Mario Kart Double Dash? People to this day still want the fucking Mario Kart Double Dash to come back. I agree, that was a very fun game. Every character had their own fun-themed car. You know, you could use any combo of people. Like, it, it was really cool and a fun idea. I wish they'd bring it back as well. But yeah, wh why? Why was GameCube so poorly sold? I mean, it could be because that was the most concentrated, I think, the video game world was. You had the Xbox released near it. You had the Dreamcast as well. And then, of course, it went up against the best-selling console of all time, the PlayStation 2. So maybe, maybe that's why, but... I don't know, man. As a little kid, and yes, I owned all the consoles. Yes, I am a spoiled brat. Yes... I am slowly paying my parents back for all they did for me. Uh, they come and live with me one to two months, two to three times a year. Uh, and they pay no rent or bills, as they should not. So I'm, I'm trying to give back, folks. I've talked about it before, but like that, that was my favorite generation of video gaming. Everything was just so different. You know, you turned on your Xbox... You played Halo. You played Bloodwake. Imagine Twisted Metal, but boats. Super fun. What else? You played Abe's Odd World, which <clears throat> I actually didn't like very much. You could play any number of things. You know, you turn on your GameCube, you get Mario, you get you get um Super Smash Bros. Uh, you get, which fucking is still played to this day. Again, why the GameCube had to suffer those sales numbers. You played Luigi's Mansion. You played, what was the Kirby game for the GameCube? I don't even remember. Wasn't it Kirby Star Riders or some shit like that? I don't even think they had a Yoshi game. Did they? But you know what I mean. You turn on GameCube and you get your standard Nintendo characters. You know, you, you turn on... Your Dreamcast, and that was all things Sonic, or Space Channel 5, or Echo the Dolphin, or Seaman, or Crazy Taxi, or the only console that had the 2K series for sports. You know, you turn on your PS2, and that was your Crash, your Spyro, your Final Fantasy, what else, your God of War, that was when he finally made his debut. What else did I play a lot on there, Dynasty Warriors? It, I don't know, man. That, that that was just perfect. Now everything's the fucking same. Like, I, I, maybe it's not fair to say that anymore because the PS5 does seem to have more exclusives lately. To me, Xbox was always... Uh, since the original Xbox, it was Halo and Gears of War. I need my Halo. I need my Gears of War. 
And they, they stopped making those games, and they stopped making them good. Although the last Gears of War was fine. Hello! I love how this updated the lore of Toads. I really hope they bring the GameCube to the Nintendo Switch. Oh yeah, fucking Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. One of the few Zeldas I've beaten that isn't Breath of the Wild. I've beaten uh, Link to the Past with a strategy guide. Because my brain... My brain don't work with Zelda games. I don't know why, it just doesn't. Like, you you people turn on a Zelda game and you just get it. And I don't get it. I'm slightly better at getting it since Breath of the Wild, but Breath of the Wild was very much its own thing. This is what I feel weird with. I feel like you you were you were used to be able to aim the flood I feel like you used to be able to aim the flood while just randomly firing it with one of the fucking buttons on the GameCube controller, maybe the C stick? Oh, hey, it's Baby Bowser. Spoilers. The game is 20, 20 years old? 21 years old? Go fuck yourself if that spoiled anything for you. <laughs> Look at him just straight up committing kidnapping, sexual assault. I still don't understand why that was Baby Bowser. How did that how did that paintbrush give him the ability to morph into other people? And why was the only thing he thought about is I want to steal Peach. Steal someone else. And then uh, it actually angered me that Bowser was the last boss in this. It's like, come on, baby Bowser did all the shit. Make fucking baby Bowser it. The last boss somehow. Oh shit. But yeah, this game is always regarded as the worst. 3D Mario platformer, right? Is that fair to say? Because they lock you in, you know, they lock you into the... They lock you into the stars that you can get on certain levels. That's not fun. Um, I think a lot of people did not like Flood. Yeah, we're speedrunning now, by the way. Just letting you all know. I remember my super dumb, smooth aped kid brain. I was like, I was like 25 shines in. And I swear to God, something clicked in my head. And I was like, wait, this is just like Mario 64, kind of. But instead of Peach's Castle. It's the Isle Delfino, and instead of paintings. Oh god, instead of paintings, it's these little gloops where you, uh... There we go. Oh man, that is insanely uncomfortable to switch that. 
But yeah, I was like so proud of myself. I was like, wow, Nintendo made it like Mario 64. A lot of people don't talk about Star Fox Adventures enough, too. I don't know, JonTron made that one video, too, about him hating it. And it's like, I don't know, man. I fucking loved that game. I guess if all you wanted was R-Wing stuff, then... Yeah. I mean, it was basically Zelda. With, like... Way, way, way dumbed down dungeons, because I fucking... I, I replayed that game like a thousand times. See, like, I have to actually stop and aim this, and I could have sworn as a kid... I could have sworn as a kid there was a way to aim it while you were, like, moving freely like this. I'll figure it out eventually. Someone in the comments will tell me they have had sex with my mother, and then they'll tell me what, what to actually do. Yay! One, a two down? 48 to go, baby. At least I think. Are they making a fucking Tom Brady movie? Sorry, I have I have ESPN on in the background and what the fuck? Eighty for Brady? Good lord. Hey Peach. I guess this was kind of a new thing. Peach is not in distress. At least not yet. Also spoilers. Yeah, eventually they do. Eventually Baby Bowser's like, I'm gonna put my Baby Bowser ween ween in you. And he comes for Peach. Bianco Hills. Oh no, is this this is this is this is Petey Piranha, isn't it? And thus would be introduced a very lovable character in the Mario lore. How did Piranha Plant get into Smash, but Petey Piranha didn't? If anything, Petey Piranha should have been in. Not fucking just random Piranha Plant. Maybe they liked him in the warp pipe. Maybe there were already way too many beefy boys. What the fuck? What? What even just happened there? I do not want this series to be 6,000 episodes, so that there will absolutely be some shines. I get off stage. Well, off to a great start. Also, this should make you swim faster in the water than it does. Fuck, I really gotta get my bearings down with this shit. Funny too, a lot of people didn't like Flood, but yet he gives you kind of a lot of freedom. More than Mario had certainly in the last game. And they build the game around it. This is also the 3D All-Stars version. So I think this is actually in HD and it's wi oh yeah, it's widescreen. That's what they did. All GameCube games were letterboxed. In 4-3 aspect ratio. They For the 3D All-Stars version, they made it widescreen. So, hey, we all get a little... We all get a little present! Look, it's Petey Piranha's dick veins. God, what else was a hard shine? Oh, fucking cleaning the teeth on that eel. And I don't want to hear about how when you were six, you know, you did whatever on the first fucking try. Whatever. I don't care. 
Don't care. Also, like, why do you think anyone cares? Also, there's no proof of that. Anyone can say they did anything on their first goddamn try as a kid. None of us were there. So you just get to fucking say whatever the hell you want. Like, maybe you didn't. Maybe you're just a little bitch. A doop -a doop -a doop -a doop -a doop Hey there, buddy! Meow! Is the implication is that he's a baby? Mario, you're literally wearing a jetpack. Ow. Oh, man. I'm telling you, dude, I swear to God. God damn it, I can't aim up. There's a way to aim with it while it is like this and you don't have to lock in like this. I just let him hit me because it's... Oh my god, you fill him up with water, Mario, then fuck his ass up. Oh, we got lucky again. Also, Yoshi is in this game, and Yoshi is fucking annoying. Because he literally cannot touch water. I get they had to put something in there to kind of... You know, equalize it a little bit and not just make him give you free reign to anywhere whenever you want. But, like, I don't know. There are some fucking hard parts with Yoshi in here where they're like, you better not touch the fucking water. Shine get. This still is a very pretty game. A lot of GameCube games graphically hold up today. Um, my buddy had an emulate. Uh, he uh, bought a GameCube and uh, played Star Fox actually Adventures, and I, I was watching him, and I was like, "Holy shit, that looks like it looked like a PS4 game." Boop, 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 boop. This just in the boathouse. All right, before we go to the boathouse, let's see what's next here. We got to get all the easy shines we can. And believe me, there's one or two on this level that are going to piss me off. Oh, no. Well, here, you're all going to get to see why I fucking hate this game sometimes. Yep, that hillside cave secret, that ain't fun. That ain't fun. This ain't gonna be fun. You know what? Fuck you. I don't need to fight you. The momentum for Mario in this game is so spot on that it's annoying. Fuck these people. Also, there were so many rumors that they were going to put Isle Delfino in fucking Mario Odyssey as, like, DLC, and then it never happened. <laughs> I wanted it so bad. How did you guys not make a Mario Odyssey DLC? How? It was, like, everyone's favorite fucking Mario game. It, like... People my age were finally ready to be like, okay, uh, this is better than 64, which, you know, no matter what, everyone's like, 
Although the young pe the young people will say it's Galaxy. Um, I just feel like that's this for the same reason my generation says Mario 64 is the best one. I'm guessing that it's just whatever Mario game you played first as a smooth brain toddler. That's going to be your favorite Mario game all for the rest of your life. And I'm here to tell you, as much as I loved my first playthrough of Mario 64 at the age of nine, uh, I fucking don't love it anymore. <laughs> There's a reason we have not fucking beaten it yet either. We're almost near the end. I think I have like 64 stars. I need 70. Oh, come on! God damn it. Even getting to the fucking cave secret is ass. Motherfucker. Okay. Let's try this again now. Please make it on the sand. Wait a minute. How the fuck do I get up there? What is going on? Shouldn't I be able to climb that? What the fuck? I think I already had it. God damn it. Leave me alone. It's been a while. Also, I wish there had been a timer that would, like, tell you when this jet thing is going to run out. Nope. No way. No! No, 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 no! No! Oh, my God! How the fuck do you get up there? Are you... Am I seriously stuck on this? What... Climb, Mario! Climb! Oh, my God. This is such a fucking premonition of things to come. God damn it! Fuck this! How the fuck do I get over there? God, we all just do get dumber as adults. Is it seriously right fucking there? Ah! You fucking, you know, of course. I do not remember ever going that way once. I, n I must have fucking glitched it as a kid. Yep, oh yeah, yep. Yeah, no, anything that starts with the secret of is, you know, is going to be a headache. This one's a little bit easier. Because it's the first one. But a lot of these levels have, like, turning cylinders and turning squares. And it's just fucking annoying. Because Mario slips. And you just have zero fucking inclination of when he's going to slip. Oh! Oh! Zero checkpoints. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Oh, boy. Oh, my God. How could I forget about the fucking coin slot one? Where it's like a fucking pachinko machine. Oh, yeah. The Game Grumps made that one famous. But did you see what I mean right there? The fact that I slipped off just trying to hit the nail. Usually these give you lives, which lets you have infinite continues. Did that not? Okay, I'm going to guess you're hammered all the way in. Okay, cool. No lives. Wow. Well, there's our two yellings. So we've we've already in the episode number one. 
I beat this on my first time when I was six. Do not care. Good for six-year-old you. Maybe you should have had more friends. Then you wouldn't have been so good at Mario. Okay. Um, I'm hitting the A button. He just... He didn't want to jump. He didn't want to fucking jump. Because he's a fucking asshole. Oh my god. Am I gonna get a game over? Yeah. You know what? That fucking... I'm, I'm upset now and we're getting that before the end of the fucking episode. Fuck you, Mario Sunshine. God damn it. <sighs> All right. All right. I swear to God, I, they have a GameCube controller for the Switch. I'm guessing it's insanely hard to find because Nintendo didn't fucking make enough of them. All right, I, I think I'm overthinking that fucking orange block part. Of course I killed that thing without even trying. <gasps> I, 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 uh, my s threshold for stress right now is low. Boop doop blue do scoop bleep beep beep squeep bleep dee What did we beat? We beat Mario Galaxy. We're almost near the end of 64 and we're starting this one. Once these three are knocked out, I believe I will start my Mario Odyssey playthrough. The best goddamn Mario game ever made. And it's not particularly close. But we'll save those opinions for that, for that playthrough. I, okay, like, come on, man! I fucking barely touched it! <sighs> I'm just gonna try and fucking blunt force it. There we go. Will that, will that help me fucking land? Uh, 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 okay, yeah. You know what? Fuck that orange block part. <gasps> no, he doesn't do it. He doesn't do it in this one. God damn it. He doesn't do the long jump in this game. He doesn't do the long jump. The little, you know, the little like, woohoo. Like where you, where you're, he doesn't crouch in this game. Oh man! Oh. Oh my God. This might be the series where we learn to edit videos. Cause I I don't I don't want to show people me dying. Four hundred times. Okay. I literally tried to do the long jump right at the end to jump. Why doesn't he jump? He hit the button. I hit the fucking button. Fuck. Oh my God. I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. I don't fucking care. Fuck this game. Oh my god, this is gonna be titled fucking episode one already screaming. God damn it. It's such garbage. I'm hitting the fucking jump button. Look! Hit it, Mario! Good! Look! How hard do you have to hit it? How hard? How hard does the A button need to be pushed? 
probably because he's slipping. Son of a bitch! I don't know if we're going to make it far in this one. Again, there's playing Mario games to just have fun by yourself. And then there's like, you do it on camera for the entire interwebs to see and rip you a new asshole. And then you get nervous. Is this what the playoffs are like in pro sports? You're just being asked to do something you always do, but now the stakes are high. This is going to be a 40 minute video and we're going to get fucking four shines. <laughs> Woo! 10 minutes of shine. This might be longer than Elden Ring's playthrough. <gasps> See, he didn't do it again. He didn't do it again. He didn't fucking hit the jump button, but I got fucking lucky. What? Oh my god, do not tell me my pro controller has drift. Nintendo, you fucking silly, stupid motherfuckers. Oh, 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 fuck you, fuck you, god damn it, oh god, do we have one more in us, I don't think the first star on the next level is very easy. It might be time for next time on OVJM plays. You're just a mouth. I'm telling you, if this starts to inhibit my ability to play the game... Oh my god, I swear there was a way to aim the nozzle while running. Oh my god. We're gonna have to Google it and go to the interwebs. What? Fuck this. Jesus Christ, is everyone entertained? I'm not. Okay, can we be done now? Uh, I should have gotten a star for that. Wow, 10 blue coins to give me the thing that will literally save your civilization. Alright, let's see. What what fresh hell? Oh, the one where you have to climb to the top to get into the wind thing? Oh god, this is glooper blooper. Alright, we, we can do this and call it an episode. This one's not so bad. Oh man, the, the the thing to actually do. Where, where was I gonna go? The thing you actually have to do to fucking get to the top in this level, it fucking drives me nuts. Also, driving the fucking bloopers sucks too. Yeah, so let's um let's just commit murder of just the highest fucking order right here.
Wait. Oh my god, no fucking way. No fucking way did it just let me do that. Yeah, I was going to say, usually... Usually you have to pull all the arms before you're allowed to do that. Look at look at how fucked up this was a children's game. <laughs> it's like peel the fucking tentacles off this sea creature that is clearly allowed to be pissed off. He was in a box. And so you ripped him limb from limb and then fucking gave him the ultimate wedgie using his nose. I don't know, Mario. That that you seem like the bad guy there. All right, five shines in 40 minutes, so there we go. Now we're at eight minutes of shine instead of ten. And if I did that math wrong, well, that, that'd be about fucking par for the course. Oh, look, that level. All right, folks. We hope you, uh... We hope you are going to be super excited for this long journey of me giving myself a fucking headache. As I attempt to entertain, I, I who knows how many people will watch this. I'm my brain is already tired. All right, episode two of Mario Sunshine and route.